Good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. It does seem to be a 4-3-3, Jim. Yes, and the importance of this formation is not to allow the midfield three and the attacking three to become too detached from one another. If that happens, then pressure can quickly be applied via the counter-attack and you can be exposed defensively. So compactness can't be compromised. And you need talkers in this team. You need leaders and people that are willing to organise things very quickly. And that gets things running. Tries to get it forward quickly. Gets the better of his man. Over to the left. Goes for a sweep. Up to meet it! Just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Gets it back. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Lovely bit of skill. He's got options out wide. Fence has got rid of that. Crosses it. Good clearance and very necessary. Pinged forward. And the through ball is intercepted. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. A really good feat. Castanos. And they've been caught out here. Chance to play it in. He's gone for it! It's in! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Pescara, break the deadlock. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. He gets chance! Back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
things starting to look very comfortable. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Tried to play it through. Look, he's offering an apology. He's had a shot! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra-sharp. Castanos has a hit! Disappointing finish in the end. Tries a shot! Well, oh, that is rather wayward. <laughs> there is the half-time whistle. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, they had their opponents reeling in that half, Peter, and the break may need to change somehow, but don't hold me to it. Cascana are in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. And we're off again. Campagnaro goes looking. Stitch defending, but that'll do. He's making good use of his strength there. Shot at goal! Up towards the front line. Hoists it forward. Uh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. And it's played forward. Cuts it out. Looks to dink one in. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Looks to bypass the midfield. Castanos has created one goal already. Tries to locate someone up front. Floats one over. Well, that's where he wants it. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. Forward it goes. A forward pass. And now the breakaway. The message is clear. None shall pass. Now they can break here. There's a long ball. Goalkeeper's ball. Hoists it forward. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. to get it forward quickly. <laughs> Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Piscata, and it's victorious here, and it's no more than they deserve. They were simply a better team. What are your thoughts on today's game, then, Jim? 